Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. To make a hilly state famous for tourism and transform it into a hot spot, all what's needed is the availability of world-class infrastructure which can bring an emotion of peace and happiness among all the people who have come as a tourist and spend some quality time in the state. On that note, in this video we'll go on a virtual expedition to understand what's coming up in the exhilarating state of Sikkim. Sikkim is a state in northeastern India. It borders the Tibet autonomous region of China in the north and northeast, Bhutan to the east, Nepal in the west and West Bengal in the south. Sikkim is also close to India's Siliguri corridor near Bangladesh. Sikkim is the least populous and second smallest among the Indian state. Talking about the history of the state, the Kingdom of Sikkim was founded by the Namgyal dynasty in the late 17th century. It was ruled by Buddhist priest kings known as the Chogyal. It became a princely state of British India in 1890. Following the Indian independence, Sikkim continued its protectorate status with the Union of India after 1947 and the Republic of India after 1950. In 1975, the Prime Minister of Sikkim appealed to the Indian Parliament for Sikkim to become a state of India. In April of that year, the Indian Army took over the city of Gangtok and disarmed the Chogyal's palace guards. Therefore, a referendum was held in which 97.5% of voters supported abolishing the monarchy, effectively approving union with India. India is said to have stationed 20,000 to 40,000 troops in the country back then. Now let's talk about Sikkim's economy. Sikkim's nominal state gross domestic product was estimated at US dollar 4.6 billion in 2019, with GDP per capita being dollar 7,530 US dollar, thus constituting the third smallest GDP among India's 28 states. The state's economy is largely agrarian based on the terraced farming of rice and the cultivation of crops such as maize, millet, wheat, barley, oranges, tea, and cardamom. Sikkim produces more cardamom than any other Indian state and is home to the largest cultivated area of cardamom. Therefore, we have understood the various indispensable information about India's best kept secret which is Sikkim. Hence, let us now move ahead to look at the top 5 biggest mega projects coming up in the state of Sikkim. We'll go in the descending order depending on the nature of mega project. Fifth up is the stupendous mega road project in Sikkim. The Asian Development Bank and the government have signed a dollar 2.5 million project readiness financing loan to support project preparation and design activities to upgrade major district roads in Sikkim. The project will help improve connectivity to important towns, rural areas and pilgrimage and tourist destination in the northeastern state. The PRF project aims to ensure implementation readiness through feasibility studies preparing detailed engineering designs of selected sub-projects and building capacity of state agencies so that the ensuing project gets completed in a timely manner. Sikkim's road network requires upgradation to all weather roads as frequent landslides and erosion damage roads and disrupt intrastate connectivity. The PRF will help the state upgrade identified major district and other roads to improve linkages to the national and state highways network connecting important towns and commercial centers. Therefore, the road project will be finished before 2024. Fourth is a mega cable car project. In an effort to control the alarming traffic congestion faced by residents while commuting, the Sikkim government has decided to explore cable cars as a means of public transport system in state capital Gangtok. The length of the conceptual mass transit system rounds up to 12.42 km with 13 stations. Adopting cable cars as a mode of public transport in Gangtok is being explored as one of the most appropriate solutions available for the capital to tackle the burgeoning traffic menace. It is believed that if adopted, cable cars can become a viable long-term solution to solve the grievances being faced by the state in terms of road traffic. Moreover, on that note, all possible options are being explored with utmost priority. The third position is the most renowned smart city project. The integrated command and control centers are envisaged to be the brain for city operation, exception, handling and disaster management. Integrated command and center will integrate various systems of different stakeholders in the city that will enhance safety, security and provide better public services for the city. Pan City network of CCTV, smart poles, smart lights, VMD and other ICT interventions 
questions are included in this project. Another project is the construction of rainwater harvesting system at various administrative and educational blocks. The project strives to improve the physical infrastructure and more importantly reduce the pressure on existing water supply system in the Pan City areas which are situated within the boundary of Gangtok municipal area. The modular tank technology would be used for storage purpose enabling storm water control and management system. Step into the next one which is the most ambitious Sevak Rangpo Railways. Northeast Frontier Railways is constructing the North Bengal Sikkim Railway Link, a 52.7 km stretch of track that will connect Sevok in North Bengal to Rangpo in Sikkim. The groundbreaking ceremony for the project approved in 2008 was held in February 2010 and the track was earlier expected to be completed in 2015. Once operational, it will be the first time Sikkim will be connected to the main Indian rail network and as such is expected to boost local tourism and the region's economy. The total cost of the project is expected at rupees 40 billion 75% of which is being supplied by the Indian Ministry of Finance and the remainder by gross budgetary support from Indian Railways. The rail link will pass through the steep terrain of the Kanchanjunga mountain range foothills and the Tista river valley. Additionally, 32 km of the route will be built in tunnels. Aircon International, a public sector company incorporated under the Ministry of Railways has signed an agreement to construct the line. The company has prior experience in mountainous projects. It worked on the Jammu Udhampur Srinagar Baramula railway link, which posed similar technical challenges. There will be 13 tunnels along the North Bengal Sikkim line, the longest measuring more than 1,800 meters. Sitting on the top spot is the world-class center of excellence to synchronize education with market needs. Chief Minister Prem Singh Tamang laid the foundation stone of the center of excellence and institute of excellence for higher education at Chakung and West Sikkim. The institute will be established as per education norms and guidelines of the center and therefore it will have all required facilities and infrastructure. An amount of rupees 891 crore has been sanctioned for setting up the institute to be functional from 2023. The center of excellence will grow to be an international education institute that will draw a large number of students from within and outside India for higher education. The center will play a crucial role in employment generation in the state and also besides developing capable human resources in near future. The upcoming center of excellence will serve the higher education aspirations of Sikkimi students who have to rely upon institutions outside the state. Moreover, the chief minister also announced to bear educational expenses of students coming from economically weaker sections of the society. With this, we have come to the end of this video and hence the citizens seem to be assured that Sikkim is all set to walk on the right path of development in the times to come. Before we wrap this up, please like, share and subscribe the channel to remain updated about various infra projects coming up in different parts of the country. Coming up next is another hilly state situated in the northeastern state of India which is Meghalaya. Let's see what are the plans of the state government of Meghalaya in taking the region to new heights. Thank you for watching this video. Jai Hind!